Some 16 Saudi companies bought more than 2.2 million metric tons of carbon credits on Wednesday at an auction in Kenya. Auction organizer Regional Voluntary Carbon Market Company, or RVCMC, have billed the event as the world's largest sale of its kind. The company was founded by the Saudi Public Investment Fund and Saudi Tadawal Group. It will launch a full-time exchange in Riyadh in the first six months of next year. Some 70 percent of the credits at the auction were generated by projects in Africa, according to Alvi CMC. Rehaim al is the CEO for the company. Well, we're here to walk the talk. We're here on the ground in Kenya, Nairobi. We selected Nairobi to be our destination to shed the light on exactly what you mentioned, the climate change issues that we see here in Africa, which is something very important for us. Kenya is a small polluter, contributing less than 1% of annual global emissions. But it has been hit hard by climate change in recent years, with devastating droughts killing crops, wildlife and livestock. Companies see the voluntary carbon market as essential in helping them to meet environmental targets. They allow investment in projects that lock away climate warming emissions that they are unable to cut from their own operations. Consultants McKinsey have estimated the annual global market for voluntary carbon credits could hit $50 billion by 2030. However, the carbon offset market has drawn criticisms that includes a lack of transparency and a limited supply of credits, as well as questions over the quality of projects. El Gizi rejected them, saying RVCMC works with two separate independent teams of experts to vet projects that contribute credits for sale. And if there is any red flag, we immediately exclude uh, this from the uh, auction.